Hello everyone, this is Ashwin Prabhu. So this is the fifth video tutorial of software defined networking. In the previous uh, tutorial, we have seen uh, the topology options which we have while creating it. So now we'll see more about mininet commands which you can use and which will help us in understanding topologies in a better way. So if I do a sudo mn which is the regular topology creation by default it creates two hosts along with one switch. So once the topology is created uh, with the help of help command you can see what all options what all commands you can use in mininet. So these are the commands which you can use. Uh, EOV is, is like exiting the topology. Exit is the same as that. Uh, INTFS. INTFS is the command you can type which will tell us the interfaces which are connected. So you can see host H1, H2, S1, Z0 are the interfaces. Uh, link command, I'll tell you what it does but it'll I'll tell you later. So links command it will also give us a similar information but it will specify which host is connected to which switch and so on. So links command is one of the important things in here. Nodes, it will tell what all nodes are there. So available nodes are host1, 2, s1 and c0. So basically now there are three commands ping all, ping all full and ping powerful. So these are there to help you get the connection of the switches uh, of the host how they are connected. So ping all will just give uh, whether they are connected or not. So ping all full will give more details about how the hosts are connected. So it will tell us the minimum time, the average time, the maximum time uh, and so on between two hosts. So it is important for testing purposes. Next is ports. It will tell you what all port is connected to which node. So it's ports. So this will give you the port numbers which are connected. Quit will basically quit it. DPCTL, uh, it will dump the files. Uh, DPCTL is used to actually uh, view the flows in the switch table. Then there is IPERF and IPERF UDP. Uh, it is used for performance management. Um, you can measure the bandwidth between links. Uh, IPERF is a TCP. IPERF UDP is for UDP, UDP connection. So if I type IPERF, it will test the bandwidth between H1 and H2. It will take 30 seconds to complete this. So once that is completed, it will give a bandwidth. So it is taking more, less time now. So this is giving the bandwidth between H1 and H2. So even this is an important command which you can use. Uh, next important command over here is uh, net. Net is similar to the links option. Yeah, you can see it will give the links how they are connected. And the last uh, important one is xterm. So if you want to open a new window um, connecting to a node you can type xterm c0 so it will basically connect to the controller directly and uh, you can perform commands over here so as to execute so these are the basic commands which you can use in order to have a better understanding um, to touch the functionality and uh, basically it is used for most more more of the times it is used for testing purposes uh, the last option is link which i told i'll explain later so basically in link is um, now that we have seen uh, in the previous video that sudo mn creates two hosts which are connected to switches. So if I basically bring down one switch, uh, I'll just show it to you. So these are the links h1 connected to s1, h2 connected to s1. So if I bring the link, bring down the link h1 to s1, uh, this link will go down and host won't be able to ping each other. So if I do a ping all now, those are able to connect to each other. And now if I use link 
h1 s1 down it will basically bring down the link and host 2 won't be able to communicate with host 1 so now the link is down so if I do ping all you can see now it is not able to connect since the link is down and if I bring the link up again link h1 s1 up the link will be up and now if you do a ping all command they are able to connect so this is a very important command which you can use in order to test the overall um, network topology uh, we had used it in our project as well uh, which you can see in the first video so this is a manual way of bringing the link down this, this, I don't think so there's any other way to bring the link down uh, other than uh, doing it, it uh, by code so these are the most important commands uh, I hope uh, your doubts are cleared about minute commands uh, thank you for listening have a good day